countryman, an Olympic champion, the new kid on the block. The draw matched up some pretty interesting duos. Sarah Hughes and Yevgeny Plushenko, sweet, innocent, unstoppable. The force of the next millennium in skating, but don't let these fresh faces fool you. On the ice, it's serious business in the quest for the medal. Yevgeny Plushenko is the new young Russian challenger, trying to turn world silver into gold. That, of course, being Yevgeny Plushenko, the youngest in the pack, is pushing the edge with jumps and stunning artistry. He's in first place after the short program. Go out there and gun it with big jumps. You have to balance the program with a lot of artistry, so that will prove to be interesting to see how that unfolds. One versus this man. Yevgeny Plushenko, the world silver medalist, is waging war with his fellow countrymen, beginning a season-long battle for the top spot on the world's podium. Sarah Hughes and Yevgeny Plushenko, these two school kids currently sit at the head of the super team's class. The dynamic duo is in first place after their exuberant short programs. Peter Carruthers, Mary Beth Petriella, and the entire Fox Sports crew. I'm Jeannie Zelasco. See you next time. Time for the men. 1994 Olympic champion Alexei Romanov fights to reach the top with Russian charisma and flair. U.S. national champion Michael Weiss taking his Russian competitors to the limit, and he has his eye on number one. World champion Alexei Yagudin is looking for revenge after placing second in the short program behind his biggest rival. That, of course, being Yevgeny Plushenko, the youngest in the pack, is pushing the edge with jumps and stunning artistry. He's in first place after the short program. This is an interpretive free program, so you just can't go out there and gun it with big jumps. You have to balance the program with a lot of artistry, so that will prove to be interesting to see how that unfolds. One, both Ermanov and Yagudin are both known for being very artistic skaters. Yes, they can put the jumps in it, but of course, you know, they bring out the full program, and that's what those teams are going to need.